Hey guys, I've got a lot of requests for this video, and I know you guys are going to like this. If you saw my previous video, which will be popping up in a annotation right now, about Comex's Flash or Flash for the iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch, um, you know that it's currently not available. I know many of you guys want to view Flash content on your iPod Touch or iPhone, iPad right now, and I'm going to be teaching you how to do that. Um, this app is called Cloud Browse, and it is free in the App Store. The link will be in the description. As you can see, that's the icon right there. It's just as a big B, and it's called Cloud Browse again. So I'll go ahead and open it up. And as you can see, it says connected to Cloud Browse. Now, the way that this works to view Flash content on the iPod or iPod Touch or iPhone is iPad, iPod Touch, or iPhone is that it works on a remote machine and simulates Firefox on a remote machine so you aren't actually on the web on your iPhone or iPod Touch you are actually on a server that is in the air that you are viewing um, that you are viewing the content on and as you can see it says Firefox so they're actually they actually do um, use Firefox as of the remote server along the bottom you have a bunch of tabs first back and forward obviously for the web pages web if you click the web brings up a little bar that you can type in the address of the web page you want to visit keyboard obviously just bring up the keyboard hit done um, this little tab button is to show you your pages you can add new pages and the info you can bring your online profile up and edit it right here from your account email if you want to use an account and it says linking to an account will save your browsing session so it can be restored so you can save and restore your browsing sessions and you can also change all the gestures like flick and it tells you what they do and you can view your version and so let me show you how this actually works I'll zoom in here and the gestures to it's actually a mouse so how you use this is you press and hold and you will see a little mouse come up and you scroll it around with your with your finger like this as you can see and so I'm going to go click directly one tap it just works the same way guys so I'm gonna go to a website let's go web let's go to my YouTube channel www.youtube sorry I'm typing so slow this is so hard dang king PC go and as you can see my video is actually playing right off the bat on the web page and um, it's really cool and I, as you can see you can view my whole channel it is lagging a little bit because it is t slightly laggy over Wi-Fi it's streaming from Wi-Fi but as you can see you can tap and it actually is playing my video over flash content as you would expect usual YouTube on your desktop to do so that's pretty cool and that that's basically how it works guys you just type in a web address and go to say like www I'll go to addicting games uh, kinda X out of the web address addicting uh, games.com go and as you can see it's really fast also so you can load it up and as you can see the ads are actually playing so you can also play games on the side if you want it will be kind of laggy but you can play them but the ads are playing and that is how you get flash on your iPhone temporarily guys stay tuned if this helped you out in any way please subscribe I will have a video on the Comex Flash when it actually is released, but this is a temporary fix for this Flash on the iPhone. Um, this browser is great. I really enjoy it, and it helps me out a lot. Again, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Also, visit my blog and follow me on Twitter, which will be in the description. Rate this video thumbs up, and thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next vid, guys. Peace.